Hello everybody, just a quick tip here if you want to play around with any emails that you've received. So I've got an email newsletter here from The Verge, very lovely. What I'm going to do is I'm going to try and get hold of the HTML so that I can play with it, see how it works, what fonts they're using, all that type of thing. So what you'll do is you go to show original on the email, find the source of the email. Um, you'll have the equivalent of this in every email client, but in Gmail it's here. And we're going to scroll down past all the email headers. And we're going to pass the plain text section. We don't want that. And we want the HTML, which you can see starts here. But you can see it's got these weird kind of things in it. Um, spaces are escaped and all sorts of odd things are going on. And um, that's because it's encoded as quoted printable, which is just a way of sending um, text. Uh, I think it's 8-bit text in you know, a 7-bit medium. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy and paste this stuff. Yeah, I'll go copy. And we're going to search for a quoted printable converter. So this will convert that back into normal plain text. So you come to a page like this. I'm going to accept their cookies. I don't need to. Um, I'll paste in my code into the encoded section because it's encoded. I want to decode it back. Click decode. And here's the result. I'm going to press Command A, Command C to copy all of that. And I already have a document here in VS Code, which I can paste that into. And now I can scroll through and I can see the exact HTML. And what I'm going to do, and do is I'm going to go open, I need HTML, and that brings it up here, ready for me to play with. Or I can sort of see what it looks like in mobile sizes and all that sort of stuff a lot more easily than I can in my email client. That's pretty much it.